Alrighty, welcome back. Box two, Adventures in the Forgotten Realms. Every time I Google search it, it's Adventures in Forgotten, Forgotten Realms. Realms. Yeah. Not the Forgotten Realms. My brain just doesn't pick up on the the. <laughs> on the the. On the the. You heard yeah. that right. So this came in and I was like, ooh, fodder cannon. Step one, find your cousin. Step two, get your cousin in the cannon. You know what step three is? Find another cousin. Find another cousin. Some of the some of the best flavor text there is. That's literally the only flavor text he knows. Cool. Greatness at any cost. Okay, he knows ha -ha! some. He knows some easy ones too. Ha -ha. Got him, folks. The only flavor text longer than one line that he's memorized. Correct. <laughs> Uh, so, anyway, these came in, and I was like, hey, Mark, you should, you should take a picture of this and send it to your wife. My boss, his wife decided that she wanted to, like, try to learn how to play magic. Apparently she watches I was like, don't videos watch, on don't watch Twitch my and YouTube. or YouTube. I was like, go, go watch the videos of, like, these other, and it was like, one of them was like a YouTube video from Wizards on like how to, like how to play Magic and stuff like that. Uh, ooh, foil bar class. And uh, so it, it was cool. Oh, I'm best under like four different sets of videos. And he's still talking about the fact that she still like watches the arena videos. What is that? Arena is a lot more entertaining than know. paper if you don't if you don't know, know what's going on. Yeah. And, stuff, yeah. and uh, so I was like, take a picture of this. I was like, this is what you need to get her for every three months. Yeah. He's like, what's that? And I was like, this is my quarterly. This is my quarterly intake. And then he saw the invoice. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, no, do not send that to her. I was like, but but why? He's like, no, no, she needs to find a different hobby. This hobby is too expensive. It's like, well, she won't have money to do anything else. Yeah. It's like that meme. Where it's like, parents, teach your kids to play Magic yeah. Gathering. Because then they won't have money for drugs and alcohol. Yup. I need three more of that one. I don't know why yet. I mean, it's a cradle on a stick. Yeah, I mean, it's a good card, but I think it's for Commander. I just want four of in course. case at some point in it time. Has green mana on it, yep. so, you know. In case some... Hey, you never know what's going to happen. In <clears throat> six years, that thing... Could fit very well into a deck. I mean, it already fits very well into decks. It probably does. Sphere and the Tarasque. 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 Oh, yes. What do you think of Sphere? Um, I, was I like it. I was considering trying to play it. I like it as an oh shit button. Yeah. But it's like, it's a delayed oh shit button, right? Yeah. So I'm kind of like, usually when you need it, you need it now. Yeah, but it's also like, <clears throat> awesome. I'll need no shit button next turn, this, this and then they don't commit anymore. This card, you know? Yeah, but the 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 thing with the no shit button, right, you really want them to commit as much as possible. Yeah. So yeah. like, I don't, I don't know. When I first saw it, I thought it was pretty good. Um, but I'm, I'm not. Yeah, I might play test with it. Might not. I don't know. <laughs> so Ranger class, this one's gonna say some play. Like it destroys non lands, right? Uh yeah. I oh, think... it's exile. All creatures and planeswalkers. Never mind. Oh, it's not. I was lands? thinking. I thought it was non lands too. <clears throat> no, I thought it was non lands. I was thinking it would hit classes, which would be very relevant. Black because you don't have much enchantment True. removal. I thought it was all non-land permanents. My apologies, everybody. This is probably even worse than I thought it was. Yeah. No, I'm ridiculous. <laughs> if it's just creatures and planeswalkers. planeswalkers. Yeah. Well, but the fact that it is creatures and planeswalkers. True. Um, although, I guess to the deck that you want it in, you're probably just playing planeswalkers. Right. So, so, but you're also only playing like five mana planeswalkers. Yeah. So you just play it on four. 
minion. Elowit. Yeah, but you play on four and then you have to take a turn off. Mm -hmm. I guess. But then they take a turn off. Which I guess could be good if you're playing control. Yeah. Ooh, all right. Flump. Laughing Spider. Drizzed. But we missed out, and it's only a regular foil mace. It's not a, a fourth rare. So we got second Spider Queen. I only got one in my whole case. I got two. I'm in, really good I got at pulling two cards. in two boxes. Normally I'm like, thanks, Matt. You pick, you know, the, the best boxes for me. And he gets all super salty because I pick horrible <laughs> ones for myself. Yep. Except for the one time that mine was absolute garbage and yours was just hot fire. Accuse me of switching them. I did. <laughs> I didn't accuse. Like I know what happened. Should I read what you sent? You texted me earlier. I'm going to. What did I, did I tell you? I hate you. No, I mean, you oh. tell me that on a daily basis. Sure, I don't remember what I texted you earlier. It was they probably oh. mapped the cases, <laughs> and these six boxes are going to be garbage. Uh, yep, <laughs> I did send that. And then I realized they're not. And I said, no, they probably literally cracked every single case, pulled that, all the boxes out, and then started filling What, what I forgot to say was that, <clears throat> or they could have mapped the cases, and these six boxes are going to be hot fire. Yeah, that's true. Right? Um, because Dungeon Descent. And a full art speider. Wow. Full art speider nice. queen. I mean. Nice. I'm not. <laughs> so you're gonna, <laughs> yeah. you're gonna, uh, take back your accusation, then. <laughs> As hot fire. Yep. They probably took. This is like totally random tangent, but they sure. probably took packaging lessons from the U.S. Mint. Oh God. So the U.S. <laughs> Mint, they ship proof sets, and they say they fit like thirty in a box, right? Hmm. We'll order like it's banned in increments of thirty. Is is banned? Yeah. And we will get a package that has 28 in one box and another package that has two. And we're like, why didn't you just ship a full case? <laughs> yes. And it's probably because they go Plenty. right in the order of wherever it is, yeah. how everything comes in. So they get an order for 28 of them and they pull two out and ship it. And then they send us the two and pull 28 from the next yeah. box. Like, But it's just like, Drizz. you could do this so much more efficiently. Oh, yeah. We, ours aren't quite that, isn't quite that bad, but like, so when we put our orders into a computer system, when you, so like, if it comes to like a quantity of five, but you need one, and so you put in one, it auto adjusts it to five, but there might actually be like farther down, it might have somebody else have the same order, you know, so like you put in quantity of one again and it auto adjusts to five, like it does it immediately when you go to the next line instead of waiting until the order's done. So you order two, but you get 10. And I'm like, man, there's there should definitely be. That's just called upselling. I mean, they're doing that's, it right. That's working as intended. <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I I understand that, but here we are in a era where we can't get parts and like they're overselling yeah. people who don't need them. Like that's the now would be the time if you're going to look at something like that to go back. Dude, dude. It's a lot of uncommons. Look, this is my common to uncommon stack for yeah. two boxes so far. It's crazy. Yeah, it was about an even split for me, too. Monk class. The deck of many things. Foil, foil. deck of many things. So that's two foils, two foil mythics in two boxes. They probably map these boxes <laughs> and they're going to be total garbage. <laughs> yep. I mean, the, there's no the next, foresight. The next four could be total garbage. They could be, like, yeah. We don't know yet. <laughs> they could be. We're getting a little ahead of ourselves. Uh, that's a Zerio. So I have a Zerio, an Elowick, and a Spider Queen emblem. So that's good. <laughs> Sorry, peaked ahead. I peaked ahead. So it's a. I was gonna say it's borderless something. Oh yeah. Time it. Oh, it's not borderless. That one is okay. 
Oh, nice. And it's foil. <laughs> and it's foil. So that's three foil <laughs> mythics in this box. It is. It is. And I got an expedition map. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> What'd you see? I got a Chroma's Memorial before that, too. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah. Either. Gotta love that, that expedition map, though. I remember when them things was a couple bucks. Green Dargan. Hot fire dragon turtle. That is kind of a weird card. Mm -hmm. like, I don't want you to do anything, but I'm not going to do anything either. <laughs> Let's just sit back. Yeah. The ultimate draw go. Yeah, I guess. And then by the time I can attack for three, you're probably going to have something else. So we got a treasure vault. And a foil treasure chest. Not horrible. Oh, I'm two foil mythics. I'm already. I'm only two thirds away through the box. Let's go. One more. Need one more. I'm greedy. Yeah. I was AF. gonna say. <laughs> don't be so greedy. Nope. You should be happy that you even got a mythic. Oh, in your I. Box. <laughs> I am. I am happy. I'm extremely happy. Because you got the cards that you actually want to play with. I need another Xanathar. And then if I get another Xanathar, I probably will play Sulfa. And yes, I know, does it even need to have blue? Probably not, but like, what are... I mean, you could also just try to work more blue spells into the list. Yeah, actually... When your splash is too Xanathar. What's funny is that there was more blue spells, and yeah, then it was just like, don't need this, don't, don't need this. Well, it's because you were looking at a best of one list, so it had all the learn stuff in it. What's that? Yeah. And that's just well, that's best of three. It's not as necessary. Well, what was it? The Divide by Zero. I didn't realize how good Divide by Zero is in the, like a good tempo deck. Yeah, that was the mono blue list I've been looking at with Demi-Lish. Do, do you need some of those? Because I think I might <clears throat> no. have. It was basically like a tempo list. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, There's like a lot of like unsummons and into the royal and stuff. All right, hand, flame skull number two. Although it is unsummoned, foil adult dragon in right. standard or is it in the arena? Boo set. Uh, I don't know. Every time I say yes, then it ends up being in the arena set. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Alternate Kalein, that's pretty cool. It appears to be in the arena set. Nice. Yep, so you can't play it in paper. All right, ochre jelly. First jellyfish. Yeah. Let's be real. We're hoping it's the last jellyfish, too. What? We're hoping your rare slot isn't wasted on more jelly. Hey. What? What do you mean? Well, because it's green? I need three more of those. Hey, wouldn't you rather open like planeswalkers and just have to go buy those to finish your playset? I mean, that's fine. But at the same time, there's like four. Wow. I'm way off. You got me all like <laughs> tilted with that shit. That's what I'm here for. Literally, because you just do this at home. So I'm here just to give you crap. I mean, that is not <laughs> untrue. Foil Ginny wins here. I'm going to have me a playset of these, though. I'm not sure what for. The art cards? Yeah. There's there's two of them in there. One of this and then one of the alternate. Oh, the alt. And then I have one of these already that Josh gave me at home. It should be right with it. I'm only pulling out the... Oh, this only should be... This should be it then. Yeah, it is. You're like holding me up though. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. Put it down. Jeez. I can't. You're holding on to you it. could have put it right there. Yeah, it doesn't work because they're not in order. Because you're going to go back and check them in order. Yes. You don't know me. I do. You're going to put <laughs> these in a pile on your desk, and then you're not going to touch them for two years. They're not going to They're not going on my desk. Buy list <laughs> There's no room on my desk. They just go on the floor in a box. Yep. There's another Xanathar, though. That's not a Xanathar. That's a Xanathar art card. It's another Xanathar. Oh, Xanathar would be this pile. <laughs> you can't... Uh, Sleeveless in your deck and be like Xanathar. Why not? 
I can, it's just not legal. Okay, but he enters the battlefield tapped. Sure, that's fine. Just sideways. That's, like, I'm totally okay with that. White. Alright, first two piles. Fire. Last pile. Kinda poo-poo. Garbage. <laughs> Kinda poo-poo. Uh... To be fair, I think there was one stray pack from each pile in the first pile. All right. Yeah. That's oh, kids. That so, first. That first. So it pile could was... have been that two packs from the third pile ended up in the second and first pile. Sure. So maybe the fire rares were evenly distributed. Except that that was the short was short, <laughs> so that means that that flipped over into one of the other two piles. Originally. No. Y yeah. Because they didn't set the box they way did. high. They as did. <laughs> I mean, at at this point, anything's possible. Yeah, I mean, you saw Rick's pre-release kit. That's true. The two, land, two of so them, two of his kits, two of them had the land slot in the pack replaced with a rare. So, foil rares. Foil rares. Sorry, foil rares. So there was fourteen. For he, there was fourteen rares in one pre-release kit, and then the next one had sixteen rares. Yeah. Can you imagine opening that? I mean. Yeah, the shop would be like, you can't play with that. Like, here's a new kit. But can you imagine opening that and sealed and being like, I'd be like I got 13 on color rares. Shop, <laughs> shop owner, GG, walk over with the box and just hand it to yeah. him, right? Like, yeah. Unless you're a horrendous pilot, you should have this. Hey, talk about me. You don't play sealed. That's true. I will be talking more about myself. But I'm also a horrible pilot. Uh, Lair of the Hydra. I don't need another one. <laughs> nice. You just keep opening those. All right. So. So far, it seems pretty good. Thirty-two. There's just get eight mythics in that box. So two 40, of them foil. Look forty-two again. Yep, and two two of them are foil. Like I I I ain't complaining no more. Guess it doesn't do any good to complain anyway, right? No. So that's box two. Stay tuned. Hopefully box three is just as good. 